what's going on guys welcome back to the channel and today we are actually picking up joy's car say hello hello <laughs> so she's got the new wrap and the new bumper on and it's really not the best day to pick it up but either way oh, switch lanes um it's, it's still gonna look good but um i saw some glimpses of the car she hasn't really seen much of it and I gotta say from the picture that I saw it looks really good so uh, we're almost at the shop so from now on you're gonna be seeing the car in a different color different look and we still got to go home and put on all the carbon pieces that we have for it so it should look a little bit better maybe yeah it should look a lot better so uh, stay tuned guys we just made it Oh, I was about to say, there's your car. Still stock. Suki? Yeah. <laughs> That's racist. That's racist. Suki with the pink Dang, it's dirty already, but it looks really good. What do you guys think? I think it fits her. It's a nice color. It's not too bright. It actually looks a little bit brighter on the phone than what it does in person, just by maybe a shade. But I mean, the color is pretty dead on, though. So it's it's bright in the sunlight, and then over obviously during overcast, it's a little bit darker. So it's not too crazy. So I think it's to me. I'm not a big, you know, highlighter color, like a big fan of the highlighter color. But this color itself, I think, looks really good on the car. It's like a subtle brightness. So I think I'm gonna go back and um, wrap the inserts black while well, it's silver. Probably just to kind of hide a little bit more of that silver in there. So I'm gonna just end up wrapping that in gloss black. So we're gonna go grab some food and then uh, we'll continue the video once we get back to the house. All right guys, we are back in the garage. We have the F32. We're about to pull in the F30, but real quick, Let's appreciate the E46 that's still not finished. Oh, look at that view. Bam. <laughs> so, quick little uh, follow up on the E46. I just threw on the bumper just to kind of motivate me a little bit to hurry up and get this uh, situated. So, I think I might have found a guy that can paint the car for me for a reasonable amount of money. Um, nothing too crazy, which is a good thing. But, like I said, I wasn't, I'm not looking for a show car paint. Um, so I think I would be okay with how this guy paints. I'm actually going to meet up with him to look, or I'm going to try to meet up with him to take a look at some things that he's painted in person. Um, uh, but I think that might be the route that we're going with. Ever since I started with this car, I, uh, I said the long term would be to paint the car Hockenheim silver. And, uh. If that doesn't fall through, I mean, if that happens to fall through, then I'm just gonna end up, because I, 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 at the same time, I do wanna learn how to wrap. And I think that me taking it off, getting the quarter panels fixed so they don't look like ass, and then just rewrapping the whole car again would actually 
um, improve my skill. Obviously, I kind of already did this, so I should be able to work a little bit quicker. And also, I do plan on starting with a different material. The material that I use is very, honestly, it's probably identical to the uh, Nozatech that was used on Joy's car. So it's not the easiest material to work with. Obviously, it does require a little bit of experience. That is why an Ozatec doesn't really want to sell to the regular consumer just because they want they don't want to hear the complaints from people that are just starting and stuff. But I am using KK Vinyl on this one, which is, like I said, very identical. I think I said it's very identical to an Ozatec's material. Um, to be honest, they use the same colors. I realized that they have... This is the same green as Aerogreen that Inozotec features on their website. And then they also have a Ruby Star or Ruby Stone color that they advertise. I can't remember the name, but trust me, it's the same color as that. So if you guys are looking to wrap on your own, look into KK Vinyl. Since you guys can't purchase uh, Inozotec, you know, directly, unless you actually have a business or have an account with them. Um, KK Vinyl would be your best bet. I had some issues with this, like I just kept getting glue lines, but it could have been that I just let the material sit too long whenever I started it. And then, I don't know, maybe it was too cold. I didn't apply enough heat because I've, I've watched some videos on how much heat gets applied to that material. And I definitely did not add enough heat to this one. So that could have been my issue. And I'm definitely willing to take the risk again on a different car. But for this one, I do want to try a different material, get my skills up a little bit more. But anyways, let's just appreciate the F30 a little bit more. Look at this. Oof. This looks very familiar. <laughs> um, yeah, I think this looks really good. Wait till we add these Husker extensions, the front lip. Uh, we have some rear extensions too that we got to add to the car. And the spoiler to finish it off. Other than that, I mean, this car would be nearly completed. Obviously, long term maybe change up the headlights do uh, black housing headlights but yeah the car looks really good yeah i think joy's really happy with it it's exactly what we envisioned don't get me wrong the silver was nice but you know when you have something that's bright like this it really makes the uh the car pop especially when you have like you know it's this aggressive you can actually pull off the color i don't think this color would look as nice on this car just because it's not as aggressive but i could be wrong honestly i mean you know this is a color that right now it's subtle but it's you know like i said earlier it's not too crazy it's it's bright but it's not nothing wild like highlighter yellow highlighter pink so just take a quick little walk the only thing that i'm going to be deciding on is if i want to raise uh, the rear or if I want to lower the front but I'm actually leaning towards lowering the front but I do like the stance of the uh, the front though I don't know I don't know I'm gonna throw on the spacers in the back I do have to throw on the 10 mil spacer because uh, this is pretty sunk see if this is enough um, hopefully the 10 isn't too much so yeah we're gonna throw on the uh, well I'm gonna I'm about to put the car in the garage throw on the 10 mil See how it sits, because that is not acceptable. Then we can decide if we're gonna lower the front or raise up the rear. Bam, these two colors look good together. Yeah, too bad we're not keeping this. <laughs> Just because I don't have enough material to redo a lot of the parts that I messed up, like the, both quarter panels need work. Um, obviously the doors need to get redone. And then, I mean, everything else, I have enough material to do the door handles that have to get redone again. Um, side skirts, they'd be okay. They're not too bad. And then obviously I do have to do the bumpers, but I do have material for that. So, but I don't know. I just think that right now the best move is to just get the quarter panels fixed and then probably rewrap the car. Anyways, let's go ahead and move these cars and uh, throw in them spacers real quick. So before we end the video, this is a 10 mil spacer and um, I don't think it's gonna work. I thought it was, but it's not. Um, we finally got Joy back in the, the crib, in the office. What do you think about the car? I like it. Is it what you, is it what you expe expected? I know it's gonna be fire. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> but yeah, so the 10 mil is not gonna work, but we're probably just gonna have to go with the five. Um, I do wanna say maybe a seven, but I don't wanna push it. So we're gonna go with the five. Actually, I have a five on mine right now that I'm gonna take off pro probably a different day, just test fit. And if it works, then I'll order another set of five mil. That way, so we can get it dialed in as it should be. I mean, it's very close. Even a seven mil might do it, but I think the safest bet would be a five for sure. Cause this is very close to what it, the fitment was on my um, F32 before I did the quarter panels. All right, so what are we doing now? Putting on the carbon fiber pieces. All of it? Yes. It's gonna be a lot of work. We got somewhere to go tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday, I thought it was Saturday. Friday, Saturday. Well, I need to drive it tomorrow, so I'm gonna worry about it the next day. Mm. All right, well, I guess we'll be having a long night. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you like the color. And if you don't, give it a thumbs up anyways. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Hey! You gonna say bye? <laughs> don't put that in there. <laughs> Peace out. <laughs> Millie, what do you think about the car? You like it? You like it? You like it, Mama? She's like, I'm colorblind. <laughs> you do? You like the blue one better? Yeah, we like the blue one better. <laughs> yeah.